America's Cup 2017. Everyone knew this contest could prove to have some thrills, chills, and spills, but nobody expected this. What am I referring to? Great racing. Let's face it, the naysayers have said since the Deed of Gift Challenge in 2011 that multi-hulls can't match race. So what do we see? Constant high-speed passes, luffs, match race tactics, small mistakes creating massive gains and losses. Bottom line, this is seriously cool sailing. What else did we see this past week? The better and more complete team won yet again. A best of nine series almost guarantees that. Emirates Team New Zealand has again pushed the boundaries of innovation harder than any team entering the cup cycle. Fascinating wing controls, not a winch on board. Splitting off foil adjustment duties to one of the cyclists, who by the way, has his hands free because he's grinding with his legs rather than his arms. One of the few details the Kiwis haven't been able to get creative with are the sails. The One Design North Sails jib package that all the teams purchase is literally identical. Not a single difference in the shapes or sizes. Each team was allowed to purchase a finite number of jibs, and the three sail sizes are a critical call for every day's weather conditions. And it's an honor for North Sails to continually be affiliated with the Cup, as our products have exclusively been on every Challenger and Defender since 1988. The best news for me is the fact that, well, we have a week off from television duty so I can slip back into a sailing role and Skipper Henneman in the historic J-Class regatta that will be outside of the Great Harbor in Bermuda in Murray's Anchorage. The ultimate change of pace to the foiling 50s. Look for the best sailing photographers in the world to take advantage of yet another set of sights here in Bermuda that the sailing world has never seen.